Ruth here, and this is my mini Tesco haul. I'm just doing this on the bed because like, I can't be bothered to move. So, um, first we have the first thing I put in my basket trolley thing um, was this The Greatest Showman. I mean, it also comes with a sing along edition or whatever. But I quite like the songs, and I did see it in cinema with my brother. I don't go to cinema much, because it's really loud. So, anyway, and this was only 10 pounds, and the Blu-ray version was 15, so I thought might as well. I mean, it doesn't have any extra bits, so why not just get the normal version? And it was five pounds cheaper, anyway. So next coming along, we have two Smushy Mushy blind bags. So, I'm not really sure why it has different pack art, but there we go. Because it shares the same thing on the very back. I have opened two of these before, if you've watched my other Blind Bag Wednesday videos. So, and you'll see like an awesome pull in one of them. I won't tell you which one because well, watch and find out, won't ya? Um, so, I thought two more might as well. The ones that I really want is like that, that sushi one and maybe a Maybe the cupcake or the... Well, it's not cupcake, it's whipped cream, isn't it? Oh, and, uh, well, the candy the apple's pretty nice. So, chicken drumstick. Anyway, all of them are pretty nice and it's making me hungry again. Okay, so. Oh, if you're wondering, this is just the uh, collapsible uh, or reversible tote bag thing I got from the Wizarding World Crepe thing. It's very handy for shopping. I just put it in my other bag. And presto, no extra 5p charge for me. <laughs> anyway, so moving downwards, we have these two Kinder Surprise chocolates with toys inside. Now, I don't normally buy these, but they were just right there along the aisle opposite the checkout, so I thought I'd just pluck a couple, put them in. These were like 60 or 80p, I can't remember. I had these were three pounds each, I believe, these two. Now these ones were three pounds each. And uh, obviously you see series two, this, this is one, series one on its own, so obviously as you can read it, it says Disney Emoji. So I've opened quite a few of these, got quite good ones. I thought might as well keep up the trend, and I quite like the uh, things, and they come with, you know, their own backdrops and stuff. And yeah, so I thought, and I also was needing some more blind bags because I was running low. Because as you know, I do three per video, and uh, I only I was I had an odd number. I mean, it is an odd number, but I had one left on its own. I was recounting it, so I needed to, you know, stock up. And lastly. I have three Kinder Buenos because they were right next to those Kinder Surprise and I was hungry. So I got some snacks for myself. It was like 60 or 80p, I can't remember. They were, they were, one of them was more expensive than the other. But it was all, these three were on sale for three for one pound 20. So I thought, might as well, you know? Um, well, I did actually get one more blind bag, you know? I won't, I won't show you, but like, there. Um, but I got that for Meg's Toy Reviews because when I looked at it, I like totally, she came into my mind because like she likes the animal, well it's not really an it, well it could be an animal but it's, she likes these things with the polka dots on the back. So I bought her one. And I'll send it to her probably around Christmas or something. Just, you know, I, I buy Christmas presents in advance. So. And that is everything. Can't quite uh, think of what else to say. Oh yes, uh, the reason why I called it a mini haul, if uh, I actually said that in the beginning, I can't remember now, it's only been like five minutes. Or less, almost five minutes. But I spent in total £36.30. 
So that's the least I've ever spent when I went to Tesco for something like this. Because <laughs> like last time I spent like 65 pounds. <laughs> but it was quite a bigger haul still. But I needed to uh, save up some some cash for some other for rainy day like and also I did look at the Pokemon magazine but I didn't quite like you know all the gift stuff but I'm definitely going to buy the next volume and that's available on the 30th of May so look forward to that if I get around to showing you so thank you for watching like subscribe for more over now